Thank you. Friday sunsets scream. Small town pride. It's our homecoming and I'm the king. But on the night of royalty? Everyone's pumped up. Osceola's man with a crown has dubbed himself the Scream King. I always cheer. Lose, win, I always cheer. If he only knew what had started two hours earlier. In a house 45 miles away. Some college kids spend their Fridays hitting a club. Here, Goodwill's the brand of choice. And Estee Lauder would cringe if she knew it took experience to teach them, don't use house paint. Then, an hour before kickoff, they move. Back in Osceola, the homecoming banner is a tradition. The 40 lunatics are not. What's going on? <laughs> They're too old to be students here. Who are those guys? <laughs> I want to get to know them. <laughs> There's some pretty good looking ones. Mystery men in maroon who will take over the front row. They're not alums. As far as I know, I don't think anybody knows anybody here. Or cousins. I don't think any of us out here are related to anybody. But they are the brothers of Simpson College's SAE fraternity. who've been delivering school spirit unannounced to small towns across southern Iowa for 20 years. Every year we go to two or three football games as well as a couple basketball games. Uh, just go cheer on either a visiting team, an underdog. If somebody asks us, go cheer on their team. Whatever it takes, we get out there and lose our voices by the second half, but stay for the third and fourth quarters. They'll serenade the queen. I couldn't stop smiling, they're kind of crazy. Or scream when their team's down 6 nothing. Or 28 nothing. Doesn't bother us. <laughs> or 48 nothing. This is the time where we get really pumped up, we get the crowd pumped up. It's totally hilarious. We're enjoying it. Which is progress. Because these stands... It probably would have been really empty after the band got done. ...have seen a lot of misery. Over the last 11 years, Clark's record was 5 and 94. This year's new coaches started 3 and 0, getting the fraternity's attention before their showdown with 7th ranked Bondurant Farrar. It's just amazing to see the support for the good kids. They love it. Some spot a frat boy and think trouble. We're here to prove them wrong and that's what we're doing. By the time the clock matched the home team's score, Osceola's eardrums were hearing a different tune. Even though it was a, I mean, was a pretty bad loss, I mean, you can still have fun. You can always, always go out there, support a team, and just pick them up when they're down. Eric Hansen, News Channel 8. Iowa's News Leader. I wish they'd come to every game. <laughs>